Hello, so you want to install Desktop Goose. Well, I'll show you how to do that. You know, the website of Desktop Goose, you can just click that in the description of this video if you haven't yet, and then you scroll down to download, and then you pay this handful developer a billion dollars, or press no thanks. Just take me to a downloads. Quack. And then you have a download button, click, and then it starts downloading, and then you can go to uh, show in folder or something like that. And then there's the file and you can just unzip it by right clicking and then going to extract all and pressing extract. And then in here, go get into the folder again. And here's the goose desktop.exe. So all you gotta do is double click that. And I guess Windows is paranoid. So just press run anyway. Hey, yes. Hey, give me back my freaking mouse. And then you can hold down the escape key to get rid of Goose, but it takes a while, as you can see in the top left. Come on now, I have two of them running, so it's a bit buggy. Okay, they're gone now. Anyways, here's Goose desktop. You can also right-click drag this to the desktop and then start from there. You can also rename this to like, subs, su subs, what? I mean, subscribe to me now, new. Can you please subscribe to me new? And look at this. He took my, he took, my, don't click, don't click the goose or he will take your mouse. Anyways, there's the assets folder. In here you have sound, uh, for example, music. We can, if you rename this to music, then, I'm sorry, why is there two geese on the screen? What's going on here? I'm going to be lazy and just destroy goose using the task manager. There we go. And the music plays because it's called music. But if I rename it back and kill Goose and restart Goose, there's no music. There's sounds, right? So you can replace these. Hyonk. Hyonk. Okay, and I extracted this one. Hyonk. Okay, so now... Hey, give me back my freaking mouse. I mean, cursor. Okay, let's get rid of Goose and start it again. At some point it's going to use this sound effect. Okay, let's take a look at the images folder. There's memes and other GIFs. Let's uh, edit this one. So we can just paint on this and then it'll appear at some point on the screen. I don't know how long it takes for this friendly donation asking screen to appear, but let's just save it. And of course I'm going to have to restart it. Hyonk. There he goes, Hyonk. Uh, let's see now images. We were in images, we've replaced this one. So this one will appear at some point. And then there's memes. We can also replace all of these. Gonna just paint into all of these a little bit. Oop, can't overwrite this one. Okay, I better, better. Hey, no, no, no. It's taking its revenge. I'm gonna destroy it before it can take my mouse. Cursor, I mean. Okay, let's see what happens Hyunk. now. Yeah, Hyonk. Ah, there we go. Hyunk. This is one of my edited uh, images from the memes folder over here. So you can see it actually works when you change and then restart. Oh yeah, and to properly get rid of uh, Goose, Goose, desktop Goose, you have to press escape, hold down, then at the top left here, this thing appears. And after a while, it's gone and you'll have to restart it again. Give this video a like, subscribe to this channel, because it was so useful, right? And I will see you next time when I teach you how to install Dramatic Llama Virus. Until then, ciao! Hyonk. Hyonk?